This is PowerPoint Lesson 7, the second lesson, lesson, Customizing the Presentation. Step 1 says on the status bar, click Notes to open the Notes pane below your slides. Well, this is the status bar down here at the bottom. We're going to click Notes right here, and you can see that it opened it up. On slide 1, in the Notes section, type Kickoff Meeting to discuss project scope and expected outcomes. I'm going to control C and I'm going to go down here and paste it. Click the view tab. And in the master views group, click notes master. So this is our notes master down here. Then on the drawing tools format tab, we're going to click shape format. We're going to click shape fill. White background one darker 15%. That one right there. White background one darker 15%. On the Notes Master tab, click Notes um, click Notes Master tab. We're going to close the Master View. Click File. Come on, computer. Not responding. Print. And then we're going to click the layout. Currently it says full page slides. And we're going to go to notes pages. A preview of the notes pages appears on the right. You see that right here. And then in the print layouts, uh, let's see, notice that the new fill color has been applied to the notes placeholder. Return to normal view. Mark that as answered. Go to the next one. Click the View tab. And in the Master Views group, click Handout Master. In the footer placeholder, type River. So click in the footer. Type River Power Plant. River Power Plant. On the Handout Master tab in the Placeholders group, click Header to remove the placeholder. So we're going to uncheck this box where it says Header. In the Page Greta, page Setup group, click Slides per Page, and then click Two Slides, and then Close the Master View. Click File. And then print. In settings, click the arrow beside the layout box currently set to notes pages. And then in the handout section, click two slides. A preview of the handouts appears on the right. Note that the header section is not displayed and the footer contains the text that we've added. Click, the, click export in the pane on the left. Export. Click Create Handouts. And then under Create Handouts in Microsoft Word, right here, we're going to click the Create Handouts button. Leave the default options and then click OK. Spinning. Click the word icon in the taskbar, which is down here. To open the newly generated handouts document in the Word document, position the cursor to the left of the slide one text 
and press enter twice. So we're clicking right there. Press enter twice. Press control home to go to the beginning of the document. Okay, I'm at the beginning of the document. Type kickoff meeting for this. Control C. I just pasted it there. I'm not sure if that's what I was supposed to do. Select the text. Type. Yep. We were supposed to type that. Select the text and then change the font size to 24. And then it says close Word without saving. So I'm going to close it. Don't save. Mark is answered. Go to the next one. Click File. Save as. Browse, go to my projects folder, click the arrow for tools in the save as dialog box and then click save options. Scroll down the dialog box if necessary and click the checkbox for embed fonts in the file right there. And then click OK in the file name box. Type River Power Plant Final. So River Power Plant and then Final. And then click Save. Mark has answered. This completes this lesson.